um, literally putting this disclaimer at the beginning. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, totally disregard the yellow lighting right now. I just had to come make this very quick disclaimer. Um, this video that I'm working on right now is not going to be the best because I was not in focus for like 85% of the video and I did not realize that until tonight and I literally got so upset I just stopped working on it. I was like, you know what? Why? Why continue? But I'm going to continue to show y'all anyway. If you're interested in seeing a out of focus video, stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing the looks. So I'm gonna start off. My hair has been in this wash and go um, for about a week. The scalp's not itchy. My hair's not dirty. It's feeling like really moisturized. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of do some like mini twists and then we're gonna finish my whole head and then we're gonna go back in and this all the locks um i got these from my local beauty supply store they are the sensual brand they are called loop jamaican dreadlocks um i got three packs and a number two um one pack in a color tm1b violet like this really cute like grayish purple and then I got another pack in the TM1B30 it's like um kind of like brown so I have five packs of hair I'll probably only need about four like my head is big but I don't have that much hair on my head so, let's just jump into it. <laughs> I got my clips, got my little crochet tool, and have a wide tooth comb and a rat tail comb so I can like easily part through. This one I'm gonna use if I need to detangle anything. So, I'm just gonna start doing my hair and you guys can just sit and watch. So I'm just jumping in to do the mini twists, but I'm going to braid the root so that the lock has, you know, a good base to kind of hold on to outside of me tying it in a knot. But I'm choosing not to use any product because I don't want my twists to shrink up and get you know a little puffy and then they would like come through the side of the lock and like put me on blast but yeah okay so I have done half of my head Kinda, sorta. It is the next day. As you can see, my shirt has changed. Um, I finally finished twisting my hair. I think it was like four in the morning. I don't like, I have a lot. But like, really? Four in the morning? I started at 7.30 p.m. Okay. Anyway, now we're gonna go ahead and install the locks. So I did not put an in-depth like look at me doing this because there's like a thousand videos of people installing faux locks. Um, the method I use is the Jazz Nicole method where you do what she calls a brist, a braid slash twist. And then you crochet the lock under your hair. And then you feed both your hair and the remainder, the remainder of the lock through 
the whole tie the knot and then wrap the lock around your hair if that makes any sense awesome if not I will link her video down below so you can see where I got my technique from First time trying this kind of hair and so I don't know if you can tell but like this part here is like unraveling like that's where I put my hair inside and it's unraveling but only on the dark pieces like usually when you have like lighter colored pieces like this these cause the issue but no it's the darker hair the hair that's supposed to be fine, the hair that's supposed to work normal. Because I haven't done that much yet. Well, I'm done these. I'm tempted to just take it out and just wear my twists. But they're not really twists. I braided some of it and then just the ends. So now, what do I do? I'm going to continue. Maybe my technique is a little off done it in a while. You gonna see. Always my time. I'm gonna come back next week and be bald. I'm just gonna shave all my hair off. final look as you can see by my shirt it is now another day I started these Saturday night I worked on them into Sunday morning I went to bed for like two to three hours I got up worked on them a little bit more went got my nails done and then I came back worked on them some more went to a graduation party came back worked on them some more and finally finished like Monday morning at like three or four. I don't know. It was like this process just takes way too long, but they look so so good. Let me take them down so you can see all of them pretty long. It's a crazy amount in my head. I think I went a little overboard, but oh well. I really ended up using all five packs. Um, yeah, I used all five packs and I used a couple strands or a couple locks from a different pack, a different style. All right. Go Bye guys. <laughs>